Hey, it's your host Dan once again. Today I'm going to be adding another little mod part to the car. This just showed up at the door. This costs just $9. And this is a bypass part for what's called CAGS, which stands for Computer Aided Gear Assist. It's on um, Trans Ams, Camaros, GTOs, some of the CTSVs, uh, geez, even Vipers and Mustangs, some of those to well have the same trans what that does is if you're not going fast enough and you kind of hold it in first it forces you to shift to fourth and I think this it just really sucks this little part I bought here it you know there's gonna be a wire harness pretend this has wires on it and this plugs into the side of the trans for the factory wire you just unplug that from the trans we're gonna take this little dummy plug and we're gonna plug that in and then we're gonna plug this end onto the, the harness that goes back to the car. I mean, this really couldn't be any simpler. But, you know, for the money, and this is all already done up, and you know, it's got weather packs on it. Um, I figured, you know, hey, why not just go this route? It's, it could be done so quickly. This is the part I got. I just got to uh, jack the car up, and then we're just gonna unplug it from the side of the trans and install this. Quick, easy, simple, and painless. Probably one of the quickest mods I'll ever do to this car. And here's the solenoid for the CAGS that'll block out your second and third gear. I'm not going to go to the length of taking the solenoid itself out. I know you can get a plug for it, but it's not really a weight savings. And why create another problem when I'm already eliminating one problem if something else were to happen? This is just easy enough. I'm going to reach up here and unplug this and we'll put the dummy plug on. The dummy plug's in place. And I just uh, use some wire ties and the other end of the harness where there's that little open boss I just wire tied it so it'd be up and out of the way I'm not gonna hang down so just keep in mind after you install the bypass the light that comes on in your cluster I'm just gonna kick mine on for just a second you'll see it right by the bottom corner of the tack right there that one through four that'll still come on as it normally would. Not much you can do about that unless you get a tune and have it completely turned off. I got this because if you're driving in traffic and you're in first gear and traffic doesn't know if it's going to speed up or slow down and all of a sudden it speeds up and this CAG system tries to force you into fourth where you really want to be in second to get going and you're not moving because you're trying to busy trying to find a gear people are up on your rear and they're honking at you and they're getting mad so this is a manual right I should be able to put it in any gear I want at any time and now I can so I hope you enjoyed the video and as always thanks for watching